Hello, we will see how to use practice test module of Gate Tutor. In this module you can do unlimited practice by setting your own test. Now we will log in as a student to practice. Enter login ID password and click to login. Now click on practice test. You can take practice test on two sections one is general aptitude and second is your branch that is mechanical engineering. If you select mechanical engineering then the subject list from mechanical branch is displayed for practice test. If you want to take practice test on general aptitude then select general aptitude. You can see the subjects in general aptitude. But we will select both. Now you can see the subjects from both general aptitude and mechanical engineering are displayed. Click on drop down and select the number of one mark technical questions you want for practice. Click on drop down and select the number of two mark technical questions you want for practice. Click on drop down and select the number of one mark aptitude questions you want for practice. Click on drop down and select the number of two mark aptitude questions you want for practice. Now click on drop down and select the time for practice test in minutes. Now select the subjects on which you want to take this practice test. These selected subjects are from section mechanical engineering. Drag to see more subjects. Select subjects from general aptitude section. Click on start test. Click on sign in. Click on next. Click to accept the terms and conditions. As you read all the instructions, click on I am ready to begin button to start actual test. Now test is started. This is the first question, which is from general aptitude. Click on A B C D options to choose answer. If you want to put this question for review then click on mark for review and go next. This is the MCQ type question from aptitude section. Now select answer, then click on save and next. To save the answer and move to the next question, select the answer. If you want to put this question for review then click on mark for review and go next. If you don't want to attempt this question then go to the next question. Click to select the answer. Click to save and move next. Select the option. Click to save and move next. This is a numerical answer type that is NAT question. Click and type the answer by using this keypad numerically. Click to save and move next. You can move from one section to other section also. Now click to move from aptitude section to mechanical engineering section. This is the MCQ type question from mechanical engineering section. Select the answer. Click to save and move next. Select the answer. Click to save and move next. Select the answer. Click to save and move next. Select the answer. If you want to put this question for review then click on mark for review and go next. If you don't want to answer this question then click here to see the next question which is not visited. Here you can see the status of questions. That means answered questions. Not answered questions, not visited questions, questions marked for review, questions answered and marked for review. Now click on answer. Click to save and move next. If you don't want to attempt the seventh question then click and go to the next question which is not visited. Select the answer. Click to save and move next. If you want to go for third question then click. If you want to put this question for review then click on mark for review and go next. If you want to move to aptitude section then click. Now click on not visited question. Select the answer. Click to save and move next. If you want to use calculator then click on calculator. This is the calculator. If you want to see full question paper then click on question paper. This is the question paper. If you want to see the instructions then click on instructions. 
These are the instructions. Click on close. You can see the important constants and standard values in user data, which are required to solve the numericals. This is the user data table of constants. Click on close. Click to see not answered questions. Select the answer. Click to save and move next. Now move to the section mechanical branch. Click on submit. See the count of the question solved. And if you are sure to submit then click on yes. Your exam is about to be submitted. Click on OK to submit the exam. Here you can see your graphical scorecard. Here you see the total questions in test are 20. The questions attempted by you are 14. And not attempted questions are 6. And the correct answered question by you are 2. The incorrect answered questions by you are 12. Your total score is 3. Now click on view test to view this test. Click on leave. This is the practice test. Here you can see marks given for your correct answer. From here you can see the explanation for question. This is the explanation. Here you can see the right answer of question as well as answer given by you. Under the reports title, rank tab is there. Click on rank to generate the rank. Click on technical section. Click here to see the drop down list. Select practice test from drop down list as you want to know rank according to practice test. Click on go. This is your college general rank. This graph shows total questions and questions attempted by you. Correct questions and incorrect questions, subject wise. Now we will see rank in general aptitude. Click on go. This is your college general rank. This graph shows total questions and questions attempted by you. Correct questions and incorrect questions. Subject wise, by this way you can do practice unlimited. Select proper group for practice. Remember, practice is the only way to be perfect so do practice again and again. Thank you.